Uh, that's something to think about. Would you lose 25 years of your life for seven million bucks? My grandmother grabbed boxes of candy. Not one box or two boxes, but she's cleaning the racks off. I'm at home eating my candy, nothing happens. And that is when it started. You guys would like this guy. He's cool, he's quick, and I think he knows when to stop. I found out about the score a few days ago. I've watched it. I know what's happening. You don't help me make decisions about what I'm taking down or not. Jackpot, and that's what we're talking, 70G, which makes this job 100% worth it. Go to a place called Slicks downtown. This place has to be done tonight. Good old salsa. This right here is my baby. You gotta know if anything goes wrong, there's some serious consequences. If anything goes wrong, run like hell. To the board, go, go, go! <sighs> Kind of a strange question, but have the cops been by here or anything? What's the name of the perpetrator? Casper Carr. I'm here to talk to you about the break-in. What kind of information are you looking for? Did you hear the story about the burglar whose car was found full of blood? I don't know what you're talking about, man. That's the one, Casper Carr. We don't have anybody in custody with that. When can these guys come in? They want to know how much money we thought he took. 49. They want to know how he found out about it. 55. So what do you think happened to Casper? I never even come close to getting caught. Hey, just take what you need, man. They're in the burbs and they feel all safe and cozy. You guys learning something? <laughs>